Hey everybody, this is Ty Taylor with IFAST University. We've got our athlete Ashley here again. Ashley, say hi. She's, uh, she's getting famous here. She's going to be on several of these videos. But I just want to talk about um, using skips to kind of assess uh, your athlete's capabilities. So when we think about uh, uh, moving well, sprinting, explosive, multi-directional ability, anything that has to do with speed, your, front, your frontal playing capabilities at your pelvis are hugely, hugely important. What I mean by that, this is my pelvis, this is my left hip, and this is my right hip. And when I push off of my right leg, you need to see your right hip go down and your left one go up. That allows you to finish the push off that leg, get that extra little bit of force, and push yourself onto the left leg, and vice versa. If I want to finish, if I want to push with my left leg, my left hip goes down, my right hip comes up, and I'm in this situation. So if I turn around, it's drive down, this one comes up, and then I drive down, this one comes up. And that's how our body's made to move, how we, how we, how we finish uh, pushes and get into the other leg or the other hip. So, uh, Ashley's gonna do a snap skip here. And what I want you to, to pay attention to, and she's actually perfect here, because she's got, can you tuck that back of your shirt in a little bit? <clears throat> so she has a white shirt on with black shorts, so this is awesome. So you should be able to see her waistline uh, clearly. And what I want you to do is when she switches legs, I want you to see the, the change uh, and her hip height from side to side, and actually does this pretty well, so you should actually see a, a good demonstration of uh, frontal plane competency and capability. So she's just going to do snap skips down, and we're going to take a look. Go ahead, Ashley. And awesome, awesome, good. So you saw the hips change, that's an indication that Ashley can drive, can finish her push on one leg and, and, and transfer over uh, to the other leg. So that's absolutely important uh, when it comes to speed and multi-directional uh, And it is, if you don't have that, and here, here's the big kicker, if I don't have from a plane in my pelvis, uh, I'm going to probably have a sagittal plane issue. I'm going to be thwarted. And so, and so that's going to create a whole other mess of problems from um, incomplete uh, drive off each leg. Uh, maybe I'll end up reaching out in front. Um, I'll have you know transverse problems up above of that. So frontal plane competency and capability at the pelvis is a great indicator of, uh, of mechanical success when it comes to speed. So check that out with your athletes. Uh, if, if, if you're seeing an inability or a lack of change, or maybe a change on one side and not the other, uh, start digging in. That, that, that's a big you know, red light to uh, some inefficiencies that your athlete may have. So again, this is Ty Terrell. This is Ashley with IFAST University. We'll see you guys next time. Done. Marcy's got her hair down.